What up, my people? This is Rob Lightborn coming at you. <clears throat> this is accountability day in number 84. Um, I hope everybody's doing good. Hope everybody's staying focused. Today, for me, was very tiring. I am exhausted, actually. I went up. I went up and <laughs> my body can feel it right now. <laughs> went up my body can feel it right now in fact I'm getting at this a little late because I actually started to doze off um, but I got up I said oh yo man let me, let me go on and handle this real quick I increased today I was pretty efficient today man handled quite a few things I mean man when I tell you I feel it and it feels good like it feels good even though yeah I'm exhausted but I feel like I used up a great deal of my energy today in a positive fashion that pushed me a day ahead and um yeah I'm pretty glad with today and you know what to tell you the truth <clears throat> whatever I got left I'm gonna go until like I hit the wall but it's like I said, I even uh, kind of started falling asleep a little bit ago. Like, I was just dozing off. It's like, whoa. So, um, yeah, man, I'm, I'm glad about that. So, yeah, I hope everybody's experiencing a good day, especially this, the first day of the month and everything. Um, stay focused. Stay at it. Stay at it, y'all. Stay at it, man. It's a lot of good things. Um <clears throat> that I see coming and it's just very good reason to keep staying at it man definitely is um, I want to talk to y'all today you know just about um, oh man I, my mind is kind of full and a lot has been going on but I tell you what <clears throat> I want to talk today about staying steady really <laughs> Not so much you, but kind of something continuing on along the lines of yesterday as far as your people staying steady. I'll, I'll put it to you like this. It's more in regards to you know what people are about by what they do. You know, it, it, it's very much time for you as you're growing to stop giving people credit for what they have said. And this is something that's very key to me. Um, do not give people credit for what they say as much as start, you know, giving respect and credit to what they're doing or have done. You know, it's time to start elevating your level of expectation in the people around you. Because if you have a, uh, an expectation of success in your own self, you have to also apply that to your people who, you know, are coming along with you on any specific journey, whether you're opening up a business, whether you're working out, whether you're whatever endeavor you have where people are going to be involved. And it's, it's good for people to be involved. And you hope that people do get involved because it facilitates you actually getting it done as long as they are staying focused as well as long as they are staying on it as well or being or or them being willing to follow your lead so you got to make sure that they are supporting by way of that in, in fact i don't even like that word i hate that word support um in this instance because I don't ever want anybody I always tell people you know if you're gonna do something don't look for the support you know uh, the support will show up on its own you know somebody's gonna come or you the support that you need is gonna come from somebody or somewhere but you want to make sure that people are not giving lip service to the situation they're not just patting you on the back and everything but if they're going to be involved that action has to be there is very crucial it's very crucial because if you start depending on what people say and believing what people say 
but it's not supported by what needs to be done. You know, oh yeah, today we're going to do this. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh, the plans just change. No. No, it doesn't work that way. Because that ends up affecting you. And the more that you accept that, it's the more that you're going to be willing to accept that for yourself. Because we as people, we have this very... There's a common thing amongst people that at some point, if you're around people who consistently fail to reach their potential and then you're doing better than them, it starts to excuse you when you fail to reach your potential because the automatic thought is, well, I'm not doing like so-and-so. I am handling my business. And you tend to kind of pat yourself on the back and everything. <clears throat> We're not here for that. We're just here to win. And so, in fact, I'll leave it with this. Always compare yourself to people who are better than you. Because then you're always losing and that puts a gun on you. That puts a, that keeps a fire lit under you. That keeps you under the gun. You know, that applies a certain amount of pressure. Always compare yourself to people who are doing way better than you. <clears throat> that, way you be, that way you consistently train yourself to think that failure is unacceptable in this area or in that area. Straight up. Yo, God bless each and every one of you. Always respect time. I will see you tomorrow. God willing. Peace.